see here. Okay, Brooklyn. Uh, boo, 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 boo. Okay, nice to meet you, Dan. What's your advice on someone who wants to write for a pra- platform like Heavy Metal? Um, I would say read the books, read the magazines, <clears throat> um, and watch the uh, the movie Heavy Metal, the movie that that really uh, inspired me to go on to um, to write my own stuff. Moon Lake is a huge inspiration, is a huge homage uh, to Heavy Metal magazine, and um, I. Uh, I strongly recommend, because that's, I mean, you know, look, <laughs> I did it the hard way, like, I, first I had to be, become a, kind of a well-known actor, and then people started to take my book seriously, but, um, I would say, uh, you know, look, um, do your, just do your homework, and, and start writing, start making your own stuff, and I always found that when I put my passion, um, into, uh, whatever I was doing, when I, whenever I just shut out the world and just focused on what I was doing, that's when people took notice. And here I am, you know, I got Moon Lake, and uh, Heavy Metal was the inspiration. And now they're my publisher, you know. It's so surreal, it's beautiful. Um, let me find this Beasley... Beasley, Beasley. Uh, let's see here. Uh, here we go. Here's some, here's some good stuff here. This is a later issue. Um, this is the middle of a, a death match. He's in the middle of a... Uh, let's go. There we go, right there. He's getting his ass beat. <laughs> He's in the middle of a... Of a uh, an underground death match. He's fighting this guy who is enhanced by nanites, and um, he's getting his ass beat. You know, he's like, you know, he's John McClane, man. He's Cool Hand Luke. He just he just keeps coming. He's like an homage to those those nineties. Oh, here's some great shit here. No, this classic Beasley. Holy shit. Um, Enter full screen. Here we go. Ah, I love this bit. This is this is the monster he's fighting. Look at that. Holy fuck. Guys. Look at that shit, man. Oh my god. Beasley is another one. I, I grew up reading Lobo. You know, I don't know about you guys, but to have Simon Beasley working on my comic book? You gotta be fucking kidding me. Ah. And Temple Smith. I mean, it's just a dream come true. Um, let me see if I can find some more stuff. You know what? I'm, I'm, that's it. I'm, I'm going to end on that there. That that was a lovely note in, in my mind. <laughs> um, let me answer some of these questions. Um, uh, hello. Hi, hi. Uh, bu- 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 bu. How do these three titles fit together? That's a good question. So I'll, it's kind of like my, you know, my own little anti-hero universe. You know, Moon Lake is my homage to you know Tales from the Crypt and Heavy Metal Magazine and um, and uh, Twilight Zone. So Moon Lake is this place that is a hotbed of conspiracy and it's also a crossroads for many different kinds of evil it's like the island in lost where it's displaced from time you go to moon lake and you cannot get out but um and it's an endless rabbit hole and endless labyrinth of aliens and demons and ghosts and werewolves and vampires and everything in between and sasquatch and you know it's like it's like and which is why it becomes hysterical in moments, because all of these characters are working alongside each other. And because um, conspiracy runs through the heart of it, uh, aliens, secret societies, there is crossover um, to uh, Fishkill and uh, Brooklyn Gladiator. Um, 
Moon Lake uh, is in Saskatchewan. It's on the border of Canada and America. Um, John Miller, the hero in Brooklyn Gladiators from Canada, he has to get out of America, make his way to Canada. Um, so, you know, there's some geographical crossover. And Fishkill is the prequel to Brooklyn Gladiator. Fishkill takes place now. Um, so it sows the seeds for the dystopian future that, that uh, is Brooklyn Gladiator. Does that make sense? I hope so. Um, listening to... Listening to... I don't know what that means. To obituary. Right? Is that a music group? Uh, you're helping me realize this is a go-get-it art time vortex portal time so don't <laughs> it is man dude create go forth and create this is the moment where everyone out there should be hunkering down and getting to those comic books that they have been putting off for all that time for you know all this time life has been too fast get to those things that you've wanted write that novel write that script write you know draw that your your comic book this is the time. This is the moment. All that creative energy, that's gonna that's actually good. It's good for the um the atmosphere. Uh I did show you. Uh why are your pupils so big? Well my eyes are pretty brown. I've always had big pupils, but I also smoked a big ass joint before this. Okay, so uh, do, 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 do. do I smoke? Yes. Ganja is my drug of choice. Um, ba, 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 ba. You are stoned, man. Let me tell you something. I've been smoking since freshman year in college. So, yeah. I am. THC runs through the bloodstream. I'm pretty sure that if I had some kind of Darth Vader kind of pyre, you know, burn me on the pyre kind of death, and people were standing around me, they'd get goddamn high. Super baked. Off of my fumes. Let that sink in. Okay, let's see what we got here. Um, ba 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 boom doon, doon. Don't forget to save the video. This is pure gold. I'm going to. Uh, do, 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 do. Make... Force Awakens based fanboy sequel. That's a good fucking idea. Man, someone's asking if I'm high. <laughs> Tesla and I are waiting for you in the pocket dimension, brother. Oh shit! I wonder who the fuck that is. Maybe James Zappy. Maybe other people. Is that him? You're breathtaking. Uh, more fish kill. I can't. You gotta fucking buy it. I gotta save this video. Negan is the man. Cheers from Chile. Waiting for the common weary. What? You know, I can't just start saying shit because I'll, I'll just be blurting shit out like fucking Ron Burgundy. My drawings are fucking awesome. They're not mine. Ben Templesmith, baby. Simon Beasley. Uh, ba ba boo ba 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 bo Was I? No, I was not. Uh, do more Goldbergs. I know, man. I always do the um, Thanksgiving episodes. That's my that's my jam. Uh, I play Mar Uncle Marvin. Maybe people think I'm high because I'm squinting so much. Well, I mean, both. <laughs> but I probably need glasses. Uh, the, 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 I don't like the way the Walking Dead comic ended, bro. Well, fucking sue me. I mean, I, what do we want from me? <laughs> I'll talk to my boss about it. Uh, you love my page. Thanks. I'm on strike right now on Instagram. I don't like all the fascist algorithms. Um, but I'll do this. This is fun. Love from Pakistan. Hey, I love you. Uh, bu -bu -bu -bu. I do have pretty eyes. Um... Where did you get those papers? Jeepers. Creepers. Uh, Sigourney Weavers. <laughs> Sigourney Weaver. I don't like the way... You don't like the way they... Okay, my thoughts about it? 
Yeah, that was rough. I did not. Yeah, that kid fucking shooting Rick and shit in his belly. And he just fucking. And then, and then uh, Carl comes in and is like, fuck! And then it's like, shoot Rick! It's fucked up. Yeah. It's fucked up. But. I don't know. What does that say? It, it, then, you know, they have the jump forward in time, which is nice. And, uh, 